Taxaw back again. Now it has been a minute since we talked about the go-kart. But I promise you guys, the last video, so this is going to be the last video for the go-kart. After that, I'm selling it. You can see it sitting on the stand up here. You guys can see what it looks like now because I can guarantee you it's a little bit different. You know what I'm saying? So make sure you subscribe below, of course. Make sure you like the video. Make sure you share the video because I love you guys so much. I'll do one more run in it. It's extra sketchy though on the streets, you know, like, uh, you know, all it takes is one of those those monkeys to pull up on you and then that's it, you know, so. But nonetheless, holy shit, these glasses are dirty. Let's uh, let's take a look at it though. I don't want to make this too long of a video. I know you've been waiting, so here we go. All right, here's the big reveal. Hopefully it looks a little bit different. You guys can see the differences. Um, I'll just run around it real quick and tell you. So first off, that bumper was painted again. Second, the whole frame was done black, um, as well as the pedals and uh, stuff like that, some of the steering stuff. Uh, this was all cleaned up around the fuel tank. This was all re, um, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Remounted, I guess you could say, you know. Uh, this was done clean, nice clean job, you know, it's nice and strong. I made these uh, plastics real quick. They're bolted in, as well as, what else did I do? Oh, so the engine is cleaned up. I'm sure you guys can see it looks a little bit more more clean all around you know so that's been cleaned up some stuff's been painted on there uh, exhaust has been painted another shot of the engine this is our rear this is a new plastic as well in the back here as you can see, looks pretty cool, I thought, you know. Um, disc has been painted, uh, cleaned up, everything's been cleaned up. Uh, a lot of stuff's actually been painted. Oh, I forgot to mention the back of the seat's been painted. It's kind of cool, you know, it's black and blue. Figure we'll go with that. Again, another side panel here. Um... Yeah, I mean, you guys can see there's like no dirt in there now or anything. Everything's just been cleaned up. Everything's been painted uh, from underneath as well. Um, this aluminum panel here has been cleaned up. Used to be, it's still not 100% shiny, but it's very good condition now. Um, yeah, just a lot of stuff's been remounted and uh, cleaned up and painted and double checked the air filter was pushed out to you remember it had to bend in it I pushed it back out it looks a little bit better that's about as much as I can push it out to make it look uh, circular again the bolts in the wheels were painted uh, just the tops um, and I mean yeah that's uh that's pretty much your general, you know, walk around. I think it looks a lot better. After this, it will be for sale. This is the final ride with it. I had fun with it, but I think it's time to move on. Uh, it's time for someone else to enjoy it as much as I have. It's only right that uh, I help someone out with a nice, uh, nice setup, you know, a nice clean setup. Um, this bar was put into 
along the bumper. I don't know if you guys remember. There was no bar there. Anyway guys, thanks for tuning in and uh, I'm going to go ahead and hop on the GoPro and uh, I think it's time to take her for a spin. One last one. You know what I'm saying? And uh, hopefully you guys enjoy. If you guys are interested in buying this, you know, shoot me a message or comment and comment below. Um, and that's it. All right, peace, guys. Talk soon.
How's it going, man? What's that? Oh, okay, no worries. I'm putting it away anyway. Sure, no problem. Oh, no worries, no worries. I just saw a cop, so I'm pulling off. Ah. You know? I'm gonna put it away in a second anyway. Just a quick run. How fast does that go? Uh, I'd say 70. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm just, just doing a little video and then I'm selling it. That's it. So, because I just fixed it up, you know, so. <laughs> but, uh, alright guys, no worries. Don't worry about me. Do you have enough space? Sure. Okay. Here, I'll roll back a bit. No, I just kind of cleaned it up mm -hmm. and like some things I built like the side and shit and uh, And like some of the back and shit, but and that motor from like, uh, it's like from a No, this is actually meant for a fucking go-kart oh, it's, it's like a racing engine oh. But the fucked up thing is I saw a cop I was riding on this main strip oh, shit. And I saw a cop but I, I dipped in this neighborhood quick But I got to shoot across so I'm waiting for the light to change <laughs> Fuck you gotta take back roads though, you can't even be getting caught acting on these main roads. That's it man, you know? Give me a subscribe though or whatever. Uh, Alright yo.
guess I don't know what that that hiccup was there. I think it was just really hot. I had to let it sit for a second. You guys saw that cop. I'm surprised. I'm actually really surprised he didn't come after me. But yeah, I think I think that's the final ride, guys. Um, you guys saw though, it's running beautifully other than that one thing. I let it sit for about five minutes and then it started right up, so. But it drove very nicely back after that, so no issues at all, so. I'd say it's good to go, good running condition. And uh, if anyone's looking to buy one of these, you guys have seen all the footage, so you know the thing runs beautifully. All right, guys, thanks for tuning in to Straight Figure Mag again. This is the two, th two fuck. This is the 206cc Briggs and Stratton. It's mad dirty now, but uh, I mean, I can't complain. It ran pretty damn well. Hit a couple of speed bumps there. I didn't even know one was there, but uh, we're still here, so. <laughs> a little bit reckless. I'll count my blessings. All right, guys. Once again, Hacksaw here. That was a pretty damn long run. We're at 52 minutes here, so that's about an hour. So, uh, as always, guys, subscribe below. Like, comment. If you know anyone that wants to buy this and they're in Canada, preferably Toronto, then uh, you know where to find me. Done diddly. Bang done. Right there. Straight figure man.